All right, hello and welcome to Florida Man Math. In this video, I'm going to show how to prove the following trig identity. 1 plus tangent squared of theta equals secant squared of theta. And the way we start is by using the ancestor of most trig identities, which is sine squared of theta plus cosine squared of theta is always equal to 1. And this is true for any angle theta. And the way we arrive at this identity is by dividing both sides by cosine squared of theta. And so we can break up this sum on the left-hand side to read like this, sine squared of theta over cosine squared of theta, and then add that to cosine squared of theta over itself. The right-hand side remains unchanged, 1 over cosine squared of theta. And now we can immediately cancel out cosine squared of theta divided by itself. So that'll just leave the number 1. And going over here, we're going to change the first term. So instead of sine squared over cosine squared of theta, we're going to recognize that that's the quantity sine of theta over cosine of theta all squared. Now the plus 1 equals, similarly to what we had before, instead of 1 over cosine squared theta, we'll recognize that this is also 1 squared over cosine squared theta. So we can rewrite this as 1 over cosine of theta quantity squared. And the reason why this is useful is because we have a name for this type of trig function. Sine of theta over cosine theta is simply tangent of theta. All of this is being squared, plus 1. And we also have a name for this function, the reciprocal of cosine theta. And so that becomes secant of theta, all being squared. So now it's a matter of just applying the exponent in a more concise way. So rearranging, we have 1 plus tangent squared of theta is equal to secant squared of theta. And with that, we have our final identity proven as needed. All right. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. And thank you for watching.